We've already gone back and set our relationships here in the back so that we could keep the firing chamber safety zone around the CO2 firing chamber at 4 millimeters. Now what we must do is we must take the spline that we've got here and we need to make it sure that it's inside the billet that you're seeing right there. Right now the spline is sticking up on the outside. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and rebuild our sketch. We'll go over here and we'll do a right mouse click and we'll edit sketch. And there you can see the handles come up on the spline. This, the change I'm going to make is very simple. I'm just going to grab this spline. And I'm going to pull it over here and I'm going to be within the billet itself. And make that modification there. Now again I have adjustments where I can do something like that, which I don't. Or I can do this here. Or again I can make you know a surface like that. I like to keep the profile of my CO2 dragster like that of an airplane wing. So that looks pretty good. We're going to go ahead and stay with that. We'll do a check on this. We'll do a rebuild and we'll do a save.